That moment when you wake up on your day off, you decide today would be a great day to go to Universal Studios and check out some Halloween Horror Nights props. And then you go to make your breakfast. <laughs> and you notice that the refrigerator is not exactly as cold as it should be. Would you say that your refrigerator isn't running? My refrigerator is not running. So don't go catch it. Our refrigerator is broken. <laughs> so now we have to go refrigerator shopping. <laughs> Good gracious. So for those of you guys that are interested in buying your own home, just know that there are occasions where you have to buy refrigerators and refrigerators are not cheap. So. <laughs> and also, what do you do with your old refrigerator? They take it. Who takes it? The people that deliver the new one. Are you sure? They, they're supposed to. We like work well, that out with them and they recycle it. Will they take the other one? Because we actually have two refrigerators. We have one in the pool house. I don't know. We should set up that one outside as like a refrigerator outside for like parties, right? Like a party <laughs> fridge. So instead of just putting that one in our kitchen, we're going to put that one out. We're going to keep that one outside. You know why I don't want to put it in the kitchen? Why? Because there's three stairs up into the house. Oh. <laughs> I, I don't know. I'm not very good at lifting refrigerators. <laughs> Yay. Let's do it. Let's go buy a refrigerator. Here's the question though. We have like a ton of magnets on our refrigerator, but we're buying a new refrigerator. So like when we go to remodel the house, we want to have a refrigerator that matches all of the appliance that we eventually pick out for the new kitchen. What he's saying is that we're getting stainless steel and stainless steel is not magnetized. Right. So none of our magnets will be on the fridge anymore, you guys. Oh, what well, do we do with them? We need to paint a square on a wall I from feel magnetic like, paint. You know what we should do is put a piece of like tin, a border like around Ooh. the ceiling. Like you know how they put, we used to have that ugly border around the ceiling. Maybe we should do one that's metal and just put magnets all over it. Remember that ugly border? Let's put another one up. Well, not, but it won't be ugly, it'll be full of magnets. It won't be like a Cracker Barrel looking thing. Right. Also, uh, it's raining outside too. Oh, uh, I so. know. What? And we wouldn't have been able to go to the parks anyways because it's what? raining. Do you know why it's raining? We would have been able to go to the parks. You say that every time, like oh. like we're made of sugar. Well, no, the cameras are not waterproof. Yeah, but like umbrellas and we could bring this little camera. It's true. There are ways around the rain. Right. <laughs> so uh, the other thing though is that... Hurricane. There is a, yeah, it's Invest 99. It wasn't really a hurricane, but it's down between us and Cuba right now. Oh. Us and What, it's 80? a tropical storm? Cuba. No, it was like a low pressure system. Oh. It didn't reach, it didn't gain power enough, but there's all these like little tiny storms off in the middle of Florida. We're getting all like the little bands. Yeah, the feeder bands, they call them. Yeah. Yeah. Bands, Science. They don't make us dance, but they do break our refrigerator. Yeah, what the heck's up with that? <laughs> best buy, best buy, what you gonna buy, what you gonna buy, that is the best buy. We're looking at refrigerators and trying to figure something out. This one is 28 cubic feet inside. This one's 24. I'm not seeing a difference at all on the inside. Are you guys? This is so confusing. We did it. We bought a refrigerator. This is it. This is our refrigerator. And we bought a microwave too. This is the second Target that I've seen with Pokeballs outside of it. How cool is that? We're going to Target. The only problem, no Pokemon here. No Pokemon. At first I was distracted by this pillow with R's all over it. And then it made sense, but then I found this octopus. This is cool. Look is at this like thing. No, I think it's a pillow. You could wear it as a hat if you'd like. I think it's a hat. Oh yeah, look at Jen's hair now too, by the way, guys. Did you guys notice that it's more red? Oh, it's pink more pink. She dyed her hair a little bit today with the overtone conditioner. And we're looking at new pans because ours are starting to fall apart and it's so confusing. Like <laughs> this is 150 for 10 seat, 10 pieces. And then this is 150 for 10 pieces or for 12 pieces, but it's counting the spoons as pieces. And like each one's a different size. Oh, it's so confusing. Oh, great. Now we're on to knives. I don't know how, what the heck kind of knives to get. What do we do? Oh, geez. Oh brother, hashtag Jen is Snapchatting me at Red Robin right now. Cause we're like drowning our sorrows and buying a new refrigerator in in burgers. You guys should check out my Snapchat and see all of the silly stuff we did today. I was a pee. I was a pee. This lighting in here is terrible. Bee, you were a bee and a Oh, I wish you had no one told me when I was a bee, I would have done a bee movie thing. Okay, do it. Do it. Ooh, I got the big pig burger. This looks awesome. I don't know what it is. It's just like bacon and bacon aioli and a burger. 
And Jen, what did you get? I got the Tavern Double, which is what I get every time because it's $6.99. This is basically like what you would pay when you go to McDonald's. Yeah. But you're getting real good stuff. What'd you get? So there's a burger on the menu called the Pig Out Burger, which is like just a burger with bacon and bacon aioli on it. And then there's the Big Pig Out Burger. That's what I got, which is like their gourmet patty on a burger that has bacon and bacon aioli on it. Let me see it. Ooh, looks pretty that, good. Look at that melted cheese in there. Oh yeah, lots of cheese. That's good. What's a diet again? I don't know. <laughs> okay, here's an extra refrigerator we're gonna use for the time being that's out in our storage area about here. But it's uh, about a thousand degrees in here and I have to move it out of here. It's gonna be fun. All right, so here it is. I don't think we've ever showed you the inside of the pool house. You don't wanna see it. Yeah, we probably won't show you today either, but. <laughs> Here is the old fridge that we had in the pool house that we were thinking of using strictly for the pool house. I just realized we need a tape measure. Why? I don't know how wide this is to get it in and out of the door. I think it'll be okay. I feel like I took the doors off to get it in there. Really? I think so. It's out here now. Yeah. <laughs> My shirt used to be a lighter color. You're just like drenched. I'm drenched. Yeah. Pretty much one swimming. Aww. Yeah. Thanks for all your hard work. You're welcome. You guys want to know what the temperature of the pool is today? How much? 90 degrees. What? <laughs> oh, it's tough being a Floridian. All right, so we got the fridge out here, and then Tim said, it hasn't actually turned on yet. It started running yet. And I was like, no! But it just started running. We could hear it back there. So today is a sad day in the tracker house. I'm taking off all the magnets. <gasps> Sorry, I'm also having the hiccups. <laughs> but, boo. We're getting our new, what is this, microwave? What is this thing? <laughs> I have the worst hiccups. And it's gonna sit right here, just like the other one. Yay! So as we're setting up our stuff here, there's our new microwave, it's so beautiful. We got a block and some knives. This is the box the knives came in. This is the box the block came in. Look at this, you see this? It's like up, this way, up, right? You'd think that there would be something telling me like how to open a box full of knives, but no, there isn't. So I'm just gonna guess which way to open it. They didn't die, look at, they look like they have like black tips but they don't there's all stainless steel Let's or see. some sort of steel oh no these are nice these are nice nicer than the ones we had for sure that's true so one of the things we got today was new pots and pans and i was going through i opened them up and i pulled out the instruction manual for <gasps> the pots and pans look at how thick this is like how much information do we need on pots and pans all of it it's like <laughs> let's see here it says before use clean them. So this is the new microwave that we got and it's giant and it has far more features than we need but it was on sale for the same price as a small microwave but there are features on this microwave that I feel like we would never ever 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 use. Like take for instance the grill button. You put this this like pan right here this like grill in there and there's like an element on the top of the microwave that heats it up like a grill like a little oven and uh yeah. You can grill a steak inside the microwave. I don't think that's ever gonna happen here. What an interesting day for sure. Refrigerator broke, we went out, we ordered a new refrigerator, we don't have one yet. It comes on Wednesday, which is exciting, but still like, we don't have a refrigerator. We do have one outside, like we showed you guys. We put it outside, turns it on, it's running, it's like full of food now, all of our food, so that it didn't go bad, but uh, it's not exactly the nicest, cleanest refrigerator. So I'm glad that everything is in packaging and it can't get dirty inside of there. But hopefully nothing else goes wrong because tomorrow we've got a real fun day planned. You can't say that because now something's going to go wrong. Oh no. <laughs> uh, all right, tomorrow's going to be terrible. <laughs> I'll see you guys tomorrow. And now it's, uh, what? Huh? <laughs> now it's time to pay the price. I almost forgot what I say.